hey guys welcome back to my channel and if you are new here welcome so i'm going to be showing you how i got this beautiful cornrow all back make sure you keep watching till the end To get the perfect cornrow, you want to make sure you start from the middle. Ever since I started making my cornrows from the middle, it's easier for me to make and it just gives me like a straight line that I want and just makes my cornrow neat generally. So yeah, I already lined my hair into two parts. So I'm just going to start with my first cornrow by lining my hair to the back and just trying to get the amount or the, a straight line that I want. As you can see, I'm just freestyling and making sure my um line is neat at the back but if you have a mirror um you can put like a mirror at your front and at your back when you are trying to make it but for me i'm already used to making my hair myself so i was just using my hand to direct um the line so yeah i'm just dividing the hair into three and i'm just going to be um inter switching or switching it between to make my corn rolls so yeah um this is quite explanatory self-explanatory so you are just going to be using that three parts that you got and you are going to be making it to the back and make sure the hair is tight but not too tight that will give you headaches or it's going to pain you so yeah i'm just going to continue doing that and making my cornrows to the back as you can see because of the um kind of um space that we have on our head that the front is usually bigger than the back the lining of my hair i made sure that the back lining is um smaller than the front because we don't want to not have space for the rest of the corn rolls so i made sure that um the line at the back is uh, a little bit smaller than what we have at the front just to make sure that all my corn roll is sitting where it's supposed to sit at the back so as you can see that's what i'm trying to do again just making sure that the line is going to be enough for the amount of corn rolls that i want so the same method i used for the first corn roll is what i'm going to be using for the second and i'm just going to be doing the same thing dividing the hair into three and just making it to the back as you can see as i'm making it i'm packing the hair that is um behind it together it's quite easy to learn like so so easy so yeah i'm just going to be doing that till i get to the back and note that i'm trying to put like brush a space in the front which is going to serve like as a brush so that um i this style is actually a protective style but as you can see i don't have edges <laughs> i really do not have edges so i'm trying to do whatever it takes to not remove the small edges i have so that's why i don't start my cornrows from the beginning i make sure i put a little space a little brush in front just to make sure that my cornrow my edges are intact when i lose it so yeah
so i'm going to be starting the second half of my hair and i'm just going to be doing the same method i did for the others trying to line it after lining it down i make my hair to the back um leaving my a small space in the front for my edges and yeah that is what i'm just going to be doing for the rest of the hair So I'm done now. I'm just going to be putting oil on my hair just to make it shine and make it a little bit moisturized. Um, yeah, so that's what I'm doing. And now I'm just going to take my air wax and my edge brush to give myself some edges. So this is the final look. This is how the hair looks like. All the cornrows are sitting where they are supposed to sit at the back and yeah i hope you loved this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up drop your comments below subscribe please subscribe to my channel thank you for watching bye